Welcome back to episode 8 of my Soup of the Week series where every Thursday night at 7pm I release a brand new soup recipe just for you. And this week we're making a delicious Chinese inspired chicken noodle soup and this is how you do it. Okay, so for the first stage of this soup, we've got these beautiful dried shiitake mushrooms and what we need to do with them is rehydrate them. So we're gonna place them in a bowl with 1,400 mils of water and we're gonna leave that for a minimum of four hours, but ideally you'd do this the day before and leave it overnight until the shiitake mushrooms have rehydrated and are nice and plump, ready to make your soup. Next, we'll place a saucepan onto the stove top and then we're gonna pour in the mushrooms and the liquid, being very careful not to tip in any of the sediment that might have settled at the bottom of the bowl. That's gonna be our poaching liquor for the chicken and for the rest of the soup. We're then gonna add in two chicken legs. These are the full leg with the thigh still attached. We're gonna pop them straight into the pan. We're then gonna put the pan onto a high heat and bring it to the boil. As soon as it comes to the boil, we'll turn that heat right down. And you'll notice that some foam will come to the top of the soup. At that point, we just need to skim that off with a ladle. Once we've removed any of the foam that settles on top of the soup, we're gonna add in two tablespoons of rice wine, four slices of fresh ginger, and the white parts of two spring onions. Don't waste the green bits, we're gonna slice them up for garnish at the end. We will now cover the soup and leave it to gently simmer for 30 minutes. Okay, so the soup has now been simmering for 30 minutes. The next step is to take out the chicken and put that on a plate to cool down a little bit so we can handle it. And then we're gonna discard the spring onion and the slices of ginger from the broth. Next, we're gonna put a pan of salted boiling water on the hob to cook the noodles. Now we need to season the soup. And we're gonna do that by adding in two tablespoons of light soy sauce, half a teaspoon of salt, an eighth of a teaspoon of ground white pepper and half a teaspoon of sesame oil. And of course, make sure to taste it because you can adjust it with any of those ingredients if you need to. Delicious. For the noodles, I'm using these rice stick noodles because I think they're perfect for soups. Um, and they're actually really tasty, but you can use any noodles that you like and then just cook them as they say on the packet instructions. For these, it's gonna be roughly around five minutes and then for the final minute, I'll add in my pak choy just to blanch it. All I'm gonna do with that is simply cut it in half and place it in the water one minute before the noodles are done and then we'll serve everything together at the same time. For the chicken, all we're gonna do is remove the skin and then simply pick it down using either our hands or maybe a couple of forks, whatever you feel more comfortable with. Now it's time to drain the noodles and pak choy. And now it's time to serve. Begin by placing some noodles in the bottom of the bowl. Then lay over some of that pak choy, pile it up with some chicken. And then three or four of those beautiful shiitake mushrooms. And then, not forgetting, topping it up with that delicious broth. And a little sprinkle of those spring onions. And if you're feeling extra brave, you can finish it with some of the super vibrant chili oil. So that's how I make my Chinese inspired chicken noodle soup. I really hope you enjoyed the video and I hope you try it out. This is not just a soup, it's a full meal in a bowl. It's absolutely delicious and it's full of those amazing umami flavors. I really hope you do try it out yourself. Thanks for watching the video. I really do appreciate you watching and I hope that you enjoyed it. And if you did, please don't forget to give it a big like and hit subscribe if you haven't already. And if you want to learn some more soups, then you can check out this playlist up here.